So welcome back to um, more construction simulator gameplay. We're on gameplay number 17 now, and we join us on our last splendid morning once again in the construction site. We're working on the noise barrier, pretty much 79% completed. So we're in the construction site said F now we're at the moment. So we're back in the wall construction. So yeah, in the last video we did a bit of um, we filled up the soil with the real world. Uh, um, we drove the DAF XF um, as you see in front of us back to the construction site and the, with the crane and then we unloaded the crane we picked up more of the noise barrier which is pretty much on the truck right now you can see more more uh, powers and elements they we picked up another, another whole lot of the barrier so it's looking pretty spending now in the back of our truck so that's what, we, that's what we want to see, yeah. We want, we want to see something really, really, really cool, really heavy duty on the truck. So, yeah, and so we've pretty much um, drove the crane back up here. As you see, the crane is pretty much um, ready to get its next um, set of work done. So we drove the, 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 10, the 1060, the LTM, the L60, we bear crane back back up here so we repaired it a little bit as well so it's not looking as dirty as it was it was a bit dirtier before but we, we went to the went to the pedal station and we repaired it so the thing is um, should, uh, the thing I was going to say I was just saying it in the last video I'm going to try and keep the crane here I'm going to try and load up from this direction I wonder if it's doable to, to, to load the crane at this distance away I don't know where it's going to go, but I'm going to try it. Let's do it. Alright, get myself away. So this is going to be possibly the final stage of the, the, the world construction. I believe this is the last... Let's just double check at the moment. This might be the last wall construction. Also, the F work was the wee bit, wasn't it? Eh? This is the bit we did last time, just a tiny bit. Bit of filling. So, we've got all this to do again, and then we've got the debriefing, which will be the approval. So, we've got to get get that done as well. So, let's uh, make a start then. I'm going to switch the green out a bit now, eh? First thing, um, we will do this truck slightly differently this time around as well. So it's it's um it's obviously looking looking slightly different pack than this time around than it was before. Eh? So we're going to take this first off. Let's uh, go on this way. Uh, we've got a queen quite stretched out. Whoa, it's fine. <laughs> Why do I put it in these trucks? Eh? <laughs> they're still sitting there. The trucks, the two trucks, still got them sitting there. With the I thought we'd done anything. I don't even know why I've actually kept them there. Just, just for show, sure, pretty much there since they're working. Let's just get this in. There we go. So that's the powers. Now we need to transport the the barrier, the elements again, once again. So it's a bit hanging a wee bit. There we go. Big heavy thing this is he. But it probably isn't that heavy because it's quite lightweight. 
it's just to be packed here. It's like, it's like, um, it's like, um, you know, it's just like plastic, um, you know, poly cam or something. But it's not, it's not too, it's not too strong. You know, I mean, it's not too heavy, I guess, but strong. So yeah, I think this will be the last, the last one to do. So that's we completed this mission, this uh, campaign, this in the first one. So we're going to have a lot to do in the next, in the next video for sure. So I might make every series, maybe make every part, you know, just call this one like one series, you know, because I've made them out of a video of this, um, pretty much this, you know, this sort of thing. Um, campaign, you know, it's taken quite a while to do it already. I was supposed to have the job scopes on high as well, it's going to involve a bit more work as well, you know. So, that's the point, yeah. It's a good point to have it up on high, then you can get more, earn a bit more. I wonder how fast the screen actually goes. <laughs> well, it goes way fast when you do that, eh? Whoa! How damn is that? Big bang there. Bit of a bang. That's gonna that would have raked the crane if it was going that speed to me. I mean they might be I mean as I've seen before, they might be capably driven this so you know, I don't know how it goes that fast when you're turning it. I don't wanna go that fast. There we go. That's where we kill. Now we've got this to do now, so one job after another. One job after another. So we're going to do the concrete, the pre-cast concrete once again. We're doing, doing what we did before, so we've got a bit of better work again, you know. Because we've got a couple of trucks, we've got the daft truck, we've got Scania, and we've got the MVM sitting behind us here. We've got loads of trucks. Daft truck will be a bit more protected behind us as well, eh? But we will have to transport the crane back on this again at the end, maybe. So we'll have to see what we're going to do. So we'll keep the truck there now, even if we're not using it. Because I might want to use them. It might, it might be the case of transporting the crane back, but... I mean, this game obviously is just so good. Eh? I mean, it's just so fun to play. Construction Simulator. I mean, the new Construction Simulator game. I mean, it's been out for a few months now, isn't it? Eh? I must. I must. A lot of you are probably still waiting this game. Don't know if it has issues or bugs. You know, like I mean, it's not got any bugs compared to what TR does on the road and the truck driver. As I just say, um, as I say before, I won't be playing on the road on stream, or maybe not truck driver on stream, because there's not very much to say about those games now. Really. Of course, I did a couple of videos of both TR on the PS5, and then I decided to add them up a bit because it was just the same. The PS5 upgrade was just, it was just the same, eh? you know. I felt like it was just a bit of a bit of a waste of time at the end of the game, we're still playing the same exact same game, you know, we've still got the same issues, you know. Still we're still stuck with a, a broken truck. Truck it. You can't roll the containers out two containers half the time, you know, it's ridiculous. And as for truck driver, you know, truck driver is obviously we're still waiting on the map DLC, which if it ever comes out, you know, I don't know. It's always, it's always, they always um, keep saying, I mean, it's heading off obviously the DLC. And it's obviously, many, it was supposed to come out in September 2021, but we've actually passed September 2021, 2022 now, so I'm about to one a year. and. We've not had anything from truck driver, you know, like truck drivers 
I don't even know what's happened to Chuck Driver generally. You know. I mean, when Chuck Driver first came out, I mean, this is when I mean, Chuck Driver was going to be like Ken, you know, like your Chuck's the way off a console. Or well, it's going to try and be like the first proper Chuck and Sim a console, but I'll see. Further down the line, you know, they got they got a new developer, didn't they? They got um, a, de a de Brazilian developer called Cuckoo, or Cuckoo, or whatever you call them. Um, from Brazil, and now today took over the project in um, Truck Driver. So, yeah, they will say spent a lot of time, I guess. But I'll say the thing is, I think with the game, they only, they only, they, they always have to, they always, they always had to familiarise themselves with that sort of genre. You know, I don't think Kukuku are really simulation, simulation then. They're not white ones to do some racing games, you know. It's like, why like, well, it's going that way? It's a white. Is this the wrong one? I will find. Like Koku, Kuku or Koku aren't really the ones that do some racing titles, and they're just given this game to on the like on the on the like on the dinner plate, for example. It was given this game to someone that's the last studio left off, just giving it to them, for them to work on it, and you work on it, work from what they given, give some new content, make truck drivers so much better, but at the end of the day, you know, never leave to, it never really went anywhere truck driver, you know. I mean, I still play truck driver, I mean, it still looks exactly the same as the game came out back in the day, you know. So we've got that done. Now we've got the same thing, we've got more of this, more powers to put in again, so it's a lot of work, it's a lot of work done. But yeah, um, yeah, truck driver, yeah, just giving the gate door, just giving this game to work on, and I'll say, it's been a lot of time. I mean, to be honest, I don't think they really did much, to be honest, at the end of the day, you know, they just worked, they just were given this game, I mean, they worked a lot of it. But the game just is the same as it was since day one, you know, you know, you know when game, I mean when, obviously, sorry again, getting off bad here, this is the thing, eh, uh, sorry, um, so the game, obviously, as they say, Cuckoo, Cuckoo were working on it, and they, I guess, you know, given, given it off, obviously, they were trying to familiarise themselves with the code in, and obviously, game, you know, they were working on it from the last, trying to, trying to know what to do, it, you know, it's, they were just giving this game just to work on, continue to develop with, but, yeah, I just, I just, uh, just, the thing is, I just never really took off when truck driving, you know, or the way they've done it, I mean, they were trying to make it better, but at the end of the day, it's, we're waiting on this map DLC, you know, we're still waiting on it, eh? Heading off, if it ever comes out, you know. I hope it does, but, you know, it's just taking too long now, isn't it? It's a bit, it's a bit, it's a bit on, and then, Truck Driver of Prima Edition, you know, I believe that's the PS5 version of Truck Driver, PS5 upgrades. And then you got, I believe you have, like, Wii work of the trucks as well, so you have, like, an, an your Scania, the, the, the Ven, the, the Venture, which is more like a DAF. It's a bit more detailed on the cover when I see them. What well, the truck models look like is good. the trucks on the the trucks on the cover look like the like photo taken or something on the premium edition, and then they just. I don't know. Is that is that what the trucks actually look like on on the game? But it looks like it was just what was taken on the trucks, you know. And then they just made a new cover. But anyway, I mean, we the Prima Edition is tied into the map DLC and, you know, and the AI trucks as well, you know, they were supposed to come and truck drive as well, but, you know, that never, that never, that never really came along either. I mean, I don't know if truck drive will ever get an update or if the map DLC is just shelf now, yeah, because this is taking this long now for me to get that app together, you know. 
I mean, I just keep looking at Sedesco, and norm they normally don't pay much of a truck driver on their sources now. I mean, it's not their game to. I mean, it's not where they're obviously game. It's not where they put in. There's nothing really. There's not been any updates, you know. There's not really. I mean, I guess they could do something, give us a wee recap, you know, just an update video how the map DLC is getting on, you know. Something might come out eventually, but we'll see. Anyway, one story short, um, let's enjoy construction simulator. That was a bit of a rant there, truck driver. I mean, on the road as well, you know, same old, same story. It's a game, it's... It's a game that's enjoyable for a while, for a wee bit, and then you get quite, you run out, you get, it gets, gets quite run out, quite, run out quite recently. I mean, run out quite easy with those games, so you know, that's why you playing guys that don't do all that, and truck driver on the road to any longer. But look at the, look at, look at the, just look at the aspects of this game, you know, this is just good, very, very slow. I know what Aussie, Aussie, Aussie heavy cargo trucks and the way that um, they're working on. I don't know if that's going to be any better because that has that has a mobile crane, mobile crane in it as well, isn't it? I don't know. Cause I know I know that on the road does not getting any updates. It seems like the only thing that they're focused on is the heavy cargo and the way now. They're supposed to be bringing a daft truck as well, don't they? I don't know what's ever happened to the DAF XF on the road. That was supposed to come out easy to go and it's it's obviously I thought that was supposed to come out but it's it doesn't look like it's gonna be teal why he's mean on the road updates. Let's go this type of HND. It's like we've front damage it already. There we go. So yeah, um, yeah, I think the heavy cargo some of it will be quite good to see as well. We'll see how that goes. Eh? But I don't know if that will be any better than on the road. <laughs> to be honest, it's still going to be a bit of a prop, I reckon. Hopefully I'll ask in some, some trucks some of it will be another great game, you know. But to be honest, then... I'll probably won't talk about much of these games, you know, try to get all these trucks and waiters, you know, let's enjoy this game, you know. So, yeah, uh, this is coming along, this is looking really cool, noise barrier is coming on really nice way, you know. Just, it's going to look amazing when it's done by the way it's ready. It's going to be super dope looking. Yeah, I wonder if, I wonder if uh, any of you play this game or uh, what's in this, and um, any of you metalheads, do you play, do you like this sort of thing as well? Because I feel like this game would have, I think this game would be as popular as um, Farming Simulator, and, you know, I feel like this game, this Construction Simulator game, you know, this one, for example, is going to really take off down the line. Hopefully more updates, you know, like DLCs, you know, like more brands of vehicles and, you know, trucks and reorders, maybe JCB, JCB, you know, come in this game in the future, that would just be so cool. I mean, they do have that roadmap, don't they, on their, on, when they actually do have a wee roadmap somewhere listed on one of the a wee thing, a wee sort of um, site somewhere they have a wee list in, so there's a, a road map for what's coming in this game in the future, I mean it's somewhere, somewhere on the source somewhere. So that's, you do have some things that are planned, and some things that may not be planned in the future, but things that might be implemented in this game in the future, and we've seen that on the road map. But we'll have to see actually. 
I was only just looking, I don't know exactly what's planned in this game, but the updates, the feature of this game. I mean, to be honest, I think this game looks really good as it is, you know. I hope they do add some decent updates to it, eh? I hope it does have a great feature transition somewhere else. Like snow on a, you know, like updates for years, you know. Give us some decent brands of vehicles, trucks, maybe new map DLCs, you know. Maybe like a modern, maybe like a modern bit as well, so people can download like vehicles, maybe. As I said a couple, as maybe said a couple of videos ago about adding mining equipment, elf movers, maybe mods on that as well would be really cool. You know. That just be so cool. But yeah, I don't know what we'll get in the future in this game, but I really want this game to have a successful future. More truck driving, you know, more truck brands, Volvo trucks would be great. I like to see Volvo come in this game, you know, Volvo Reloaders, the rate excavators as well, so no doubt. I feel like Volvo will have a hard chance to have a high chance coming to this game, you know, Volvo, Volvo make excavators as well. Earth mover equipment, you know, it's it's one of those it's one of those brands that would be it would be another brand that would come to this game in the future, Volvo. I'll wait to see Volvo reloaders. I know they're coming to farming some later of course, you know, the the platinum DLC very soon. Oh, it might be out now, you know. But if I'm recording this sort of early November, it's coming out in the middle of November, isn't it? The problem with this and the farms and whatever, so. You know, and that's going to have Volvo trucks, it's going to be bringing a Volvo F8 as well. The new Volvo F8 and the old Volvo as well, the old F16 and the F F8 16. So they actually are bringing the new Volvo truck and the old Volvo truck, so that's going to be cool. And I think there's a Volvo, a Volvo and um, what's that? Same uh, American Volvo as well coming. So there's going to be the, the European Volvos and there's going to be some of the some of the American Volvo, uh, American Volvo trucks. That's what I saw. It's gonna be cool, I think. Well, well it's gonna be it's gonna bring out a lot of fans, I reckon. I mean, I remember seeing that trailer on YouTube that's a long time ago. You mean that that um, bit, you know that 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 um, you know that we trailer that, that that female went into. It was like a wee simulator in in a room and that, you know, it was a bit cool. But she was driving that massive wheel with her, you know. And then, then you actually have it in front of your computer scene, you know. That's it, yeah. that was quite cool. I mean, just looking back at that trivia again, it was so cool. Whoa, whoa. Come to farming somewhere. But, Volvo should come to this game as well, no doubt. I really like Volvo if you'd be an art. I reckon Volvo would be tempting. And if they get, if they bring Volvo to this game, they can bring Volvo F8s, Volvo Volvo trucks to this game as well. Like we'll have every truck brand in this game almost. Just Volvo and obviously Mercedes and a Beko we're missing, but you know it's coming a lot. It's come funny enough because they tell more trucking. The brands that we've got at the moment are quite good anyway. Scania, Volvo. Came with Mac, Mac trucks as well. You know, there's a good amount of trucks, both American and European. So they do have, you know, both brands of trucks. And I feel like um, most of the games they can get. Uh, it's quite. I feel like most of the video games these days, a lot of uh, these companies appreciate their stuff in the video games. So that's why they bring them at games these these days. A lot of Truck brands, you know, farming simulator. I'm pretty sure no MVM, they seem to bring all their 
the stuff really playing that's in every game, don't they? It's always MEM vehicles and trucks and buses, you know. Like every video game there's always an MEM vehicle, isn't there? That's similar to everything, pretty much. What's not to like, eh? Hey? MEMs also one of the exclusive bands to be in lots of some racing games, you know. There we have it. There we go. We're done. We just need to clear the site up first of all, but there we go, my body is looking really good. Let's get this packed in. Let's pack this crane back in again. There we go. Um, let's do this to dry mode. This crane will go back on the truck. So I think uh, we're almost done this and I think 99% apparently come to that. The do refill I need to get on with. Just once I get this all cleared up, there, that's what I need to do. And you move our truck as well. But what I'm going to do is, yeah, I'm going to load the crane back up on the truck again. So we're going to transport this back towards the construction, the dealership to sell it. I mean, return it, I should say. Let's get that in. But once we move the truck out of the way, don't we? Let's get ourselves on again. That'll be the last time we'll be possibly using the truck now. Maybe. That was quite easy going that one, first time around, got it on straight away. Let's, uh, let's get it secured. Let's extend the lamp again. Let's just to reverse ourselves out here before we can get um, it properly completed. I don't know if I'm going to have to reverse this, but I'm going to bring this back on the there, on the side of the road there, I think, yeah. It's getting dark already. Can't even see. It's very tight. I'm just going to pull it up here, I think, just to get the way here. So we need to speak to the mayor now. I think that's the last thing you do. By the looks of it, it's going to be fun. See what um. See what she's got to say now. What's she got to say? It's obvious that you and your team are professionals since everyone seems to be very satisfied with your work. I should have taken care of this much sooner, but sometimes it's hard to determine whom you should help first. It's funny that you can get people so excited just by installing fiber optic cables. But once again, it shows how important it is to have a good and comprehensive infrastructure. There we go. <laughs> We've done it. Wow. So this is it then. We're done. Everybody there. It's a bit of a pack of either then. Free pack. It's been cool. Yeah, so they must be satisfied with my work now. That's just so good, eh? Good job. Also, we must have laid down fiber optic cable as well. 
I've got to move all this stuff out of the way where a bit of a mess here. Oh, we're causing a bit of a jam. Let's, um, yeah, let's go in then. Let's get a wee quick mini up here. Um, I'm going to, I'm going to store this. And I'm going to store this truck. So we can get ourselves on the road here, that's the reason why I have to take them away. I better get this thing moved quickly. Yeah, we're causing a bit of a tail back here. <laughs> well, right, let's get everything set. Right, we'll be on our way. we get ourselves on the way. We've got on the road here. First, last bit of driving in the heavy haul vehicle, possibly. And now we've finished the delivery of the, the, the noise barrier is all completed now, then we might as well make a bit of a journey back and turn this crane back to the such and site. That was just amazing eh, getting that done, eh? That's a lot of work. But yeah, we're gonna have a few videos I guess on the channel. I'm going to just double check where we're we going. That's um it's a bit of marker. It's telling me we've got the whole long way right to the other side of the town, what the heck? Let's go this way. It's not that way. It's just um, it's getting a bit 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 sporadic than now, so let's go on this way. Bit of last bit of driving this in the daft, I think, because we're going to take this away. It's been pretty fun, that's the way. I hope you have enjoyed a bit of this truck driving, you know. It's been good. Truck driving's really good. We're going to get through this. Oh, I've won the light again. Oh, let's go outside again. I'm clocking this way again. Yeah, causing a bit of chaos here. This. Yeah, it's tight. There's the green man on. That's what I mean. Really tight getting us to move the maneuvers. So this might be the last time we'll be driving this truck in this video, but we might as well bring this truck out again in the next video. Like just for now, we're just yeah, we're just getting, we're just doing a bit of driving. You know, it's never know. We'll be doing a bit more truck driving. You know, it's just so good that we actually have this 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 aspect of trucking, you know, heavy hauling, hauling a crane, you know, hauling it back. Just as long as we don't fast travel, then we can do more driving, you know, that's the point. I like to show you both things, I mean, I only use fast travel now and again, maybe if I wanted to quickly check something, you know, for example, that's all just fast travel, but just to drive the vehicles, I mean, that's the enjoyment. So here we are. Gonna pull up here again. Put a massive, massive uh, road back into the dealership. I think I'll just pull myself up here. I think we use base stats to just move ourselves. Just pack the truck here. Let's just uh, leave ourselves here. Let's give ourselves a wee bit of a reverse here. Yeah, uh, so yeah, I think we'll just leave the track here, I think. Yeah, let's just weave ourselves in um, packed here. So 
So, yeah. Um, so we take the crane off there. Eh? Let's take the crane off. Oh, so we have the crane on because that was quite cool at that, eh? Uh, yeah, let's, uh, yeah, that's just the end of the video off here. We'll sell the crane on, we'll just do that off stream, take the crane and sell we turn these vehicles off stream. So yeah, there we have it. Noise barriers completed. Complete. Um, I've managed to get that all done. Uh, let's have a look at the, the campaign. So we've done, we've, we've done that one. Noise barrier. Quick and quiet. So the next one is train station. It's it's um, extension. So that would be quite fun to do. So maybe get some more 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 people using the trains rather than using using their cars. You know. So that would be quite cool. So yeah, uh, so that would be fun. So we'll definitely work on that in the next video. I mean, this is the thing, this will be loads of videos like construction simulator on the channel, no doubt. I mean, I'm probably going to do millions of videos. I mean, that's the thing. I mean, I'm not going to get bored of this game anytime soon, you know. There's lots of stuff to do and there's lots of enjoyment to get involved as well. So I think this game is going to just be fun to play, so. So, anyway, and again, I hope you have enjoyed this part. Um, this part of construction somewhere else. Um make sure to like, comment and subscribe to the channel. Um of course I'll have the playlists at the end for you guys to check out all so add it along the screen as you can see. Uh and yeah we'll pretty much then continue possibly the trend the the way it spans in the next video. So that should be quite fun. So yeah, so Bye for now.